The long running row dispute over the weight of school bags hasn't gone away because of COVID-19 and Clare Councillor Anne Norton is now the latest to bring this issue but to the attention of the Department of Education. Anne joins us here on Lunchtime Live this afternoon. Um, What's the issue you've spotted, Councillor? Um, Well, I think the fact that we're in a pandemic is actually worse now because the lockers in schools are not um, accessible um, due to COVID. And this this is something that has been going on for a long, long time, not just now. And you see so many young people uh, walking to school um, or cycling to school or being dropped. But the issue is that the weight of their school bags, the weight of their books, um, are it, it is actually doing untold damage to them at a young age. They're they're growing uh, at this particular time, especially for secondary school t- uh, students. Um, and I think it's something that needs to be highlighted until somebody actually takes heed. Um, and I felt that the Minister for Education needs to look at this and do an overhaul. Um, I think down the line, we have to look at the health and well-being of the younger generation because when they're 30 and 40 and they're wondering why they have neck issues and back issues, they they might not look back and say, well, it was because of my school bag. Mm -hmm. But I think it needs to be looked at now um, and there's lots of ways that can be done. Now, I have a, a 16-year-old myself. Okay, yeah. Um, and I already have him going to physio because he's complaining of low back pain. And are you blaming uh, the school bag for that? Well, not the bag, but what's in the bag? Well, I would presume it has something, you know, to do yeah. with it because w- when you actually feel the weight of his school bag um, on different days, depending on the subject he has, it it isn't uh, it isn't something that you would be encouraging, but unfortunately we don't have a choice because they're requested to bring certain books to school um, every day, and now because of COVID they have no option. Uh, because they don't have mm. lockers. I, I want so, to ask you about that, Han. You mentioned that there a few moments mm. ago. Why are the lockers? What's the impact of COVID and lockers? Um, they they. No school is allowed to use the lockers Why? Uh, in a school um, when they return back to school in September because of COVID. Um, again, it would be down to, um, I would say, passing on the germs. Um, and the amount of lockers that are in schools would be massive. And the fact that they would have to be cleaned so many times sure, do, do, you, do you not have your do, the, do students not have their own individual lockers so surely they other would, people but they're all connected um, and that is the one thing that the department had said when the students returned back to school that lockers were not available to them uh, because of the COVID pandemic mm. so it is an issue yeah um, okay and it's more of an issue now but this As I said, this is a problem that um, is going on for a long time. Oh yeah, this is a for from when I was in school. 